Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have x plus y equals to 20 and x y equals to 200. We solve this problem for the values of x and y. So we call first this is our equation number 1 and we call this is our equation number 2. First we focus on equation number 1 so that from equation number 1 we have here we need to move this x to the right hand side and we get the value of y equals to 20 minus x and we call this is our equation number 3 okay so uh, now uh, in the next step here we need to uh, put the value of y in equation number 2 so that equation number 2 is implies that this is x y and the value of y is 20 minus x equals to 200 okay we need uh, some simplification here so first we multiply this x on both of these terms and it will be written as 20x minus x times of x becomes x squared and this is equals to 200 so this is quadratic equation but not into the standard form so that we need to convert this into the standard form uh, so we move these two terms to the right hand side when we move this minus x square to the right hand side it will becomes plus x square when we move this plus 20 to the right hand side it will becomes minus 20x and this is a plus 200 equals to 0. So this equation will become quadratic in x variable so now in order to solve this equation we need to apply the quadratic formula so first we write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 1 b equals to minus 20 and c equals to 200 and the quadratic formula is stated as minus b plus minus uh, square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a this is the our quadratic formula and now we put the values of a b and c in this formula and here we have the value of b is minus 20 plus minus square root of b square b is minus 20 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is 200 and it is divided by 2 times of a here our a is equals to 1 here we need more simplification and you see that this is minus times of minus becomes 20 and plus minus square root of uh, now here you know that uh, the square of minus 20 the square of minus becomes positive and the square of 20 becomes 400 minus 4 times of 200 equals to 800 and it is divided by 2 times of 1 equals to 2 okay further you see here we need to simplify these terms and we write it as 20 plus minus 400 minus 800 becomes minus 400 and it is divided by 2 so this uh, equation implies that uh, here we need to uh, separate this square root on both of these terms and it will be written as 20 plus minus square root of 400 multiplied by by square root of minus 1 and it is divided by 2 okay so in the next step we have uh, 20 plus minus we know that the square root of 400 equals to 20 and the square root of minus 1 equals to iota and it is divided by 2 so here uh, we need to break this fraction and we write it as so that uh, when you break this fraction it will be written as x equals to 20 over 2 plus minus 20 over 2 into iota okay here we need more simplifications in order to find the values of x so uh, these are cancelled by each other 2 times are 20 similarly this is also 2 times are 20 and we get the values of x are 10 plus minus 10 iota these are the two values of x these are the complex values so now in order to find the uh, other value to find the values of y we need to uh, focus on equation number three so that equation number three is implies that y equals to 20 minus x this is our equation number two and now here we divide this equation into the two cases here we write the positive value of x it is 10 plus 10 iota and here we write the negative value of x it is 10 minus 10 iota these are the two values of 
x and now we substitute these two values of x into this equation and we get the corresponding values of y when you put this value of x here it will be written as y equals to 20 minus x the value of x is 10 plus 10 iota and here you we need to multiply this negative sign on both of these terms and it will be written as 20 minus 10 minus 10 iota and you get the value of y is 20 minus 10 becomes 10 minus 10 iota this is the value of y corresponding to the value of x is this okay so now we need to find uh, the second value second case here so now we put this value of x here and we write it as y equals to 20 minus x and the value of x is 10 minus 10 iota here we need to multiply this negative sign on both of these terms it will be written as 20 minus 10 plus 10 iota so you get the value of y equals to 20 minus 10 is 10 plus 10 iota this is the value of y corresponding to the value of x is this one okay so finally we have uh, there are two solutions of the given equation uh, so we write these two solutions as uh, here you have the values of x y equals to the first solution is the value of x is 10 plus 10 iota the value of y is 10 minus 10 iota this is the first solution and the second solution is 10 the value of x is 10 minus 10 iota the value of y is 10 plus 10 iota these are the two solutions of the given equation and now in the next step we need to verify these two uh, solutions of the given equation so that in order to verify these two solutions now uh, we need to copy down the given question statement so the first equation of the given system is x y equals to 20 and the second equation is x y equals to 200 so here i can just verify this first solution and I can left the second verification of second solution for up to you. You can verify the second solution by yourself. Okay. So uh, here this is the value of x. This is the value of y. We need to substitute these two values in the first equation. And after that we put this into the second equation. So first we substitute these values into the first equation. The value of x is 10 plus 10 iota plus the value of y is 10 minus 10 iota equals to 20 so this is minus 10 plus 10 iota are cancelled by each other and you get 10 plus 10 is 20 equals to 20 this shows that the value of x and y satisfied our first equation and now we can check the uh, these two values into the second equation so this is x y the value of x is 10 plus 10 iota and the value of y is 10 minus 10 iota we check that is this equals to 200 or not okay so here we can apply the uh, nice algebraic formula it will be written as 10 square minus 10 square iota square equals to 200 so we know that uh, 10 square equals 200 this 10 square also equals 200 and iota square equals to minus 1 so when you put a minus 1 here it will becomes plus and this is equals to 200 so 100 plus 100 becomes 200 equals to 200 and this shows that the value of x and y satisfy the second equation as well this shows that this equation satisfies the given question and thank you this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos